paramedics struggle to save a local toddler overdosing on opioids Christmas Day. But as they were dealing with that, police say they were also dealing with the boy's mother who allegedly had a problem with paramedics use of Narcan. News 9's crime tracker Jennifer Pierce with the bizarre story. Oklahoma City police arrested the two year old's mother. They say she initially refused to let paramedics use Narcon on the child and then allegedly tried to remove him from the ambulance. First responders found the two year old unconscious in a bed at the family's Northwest Oklahoma City apartment just after midnight Christmas Day. This child was in medical distress. According to the report, the boy's mother, Tanisha McKenzie, called 911. Paramedics told police they had to explain to the uncooperative mother why Narcan was needed to save the child's life. The two year old appeared to have suffered some type of opioid overdose. It is unclear at this time how the child received the the drugs where the, uh, the child found them or uh, somebody inadvertently gave it to them. Police say the boy's father was also home. The parents accused each other of illegal drug use and did not have consistent stories. Officers did a safety sweep of the home but did not find any evidence of drugs. Paramedics were able to revive the child with Narcan and put him on an ambulance for the hospital. McKenzie also got on board and allegedly tried to take her son off the gurney. She apparently created quite a ruckus there at the scene as they were trying to treat the child. Police arrested McKenzie at the scene for child neglect and disorderly conduct. Ultimately, she was booked into the Oklahoma County Detention Center on a number of charges. Police say there were two other children in the home and DHS was called to the scene. In the newsroom, Jennifer Pierce, Oklahoma's own News 9.